Hello, and welcome to day 11 of Find Your Flow. Today's pose is Bhujangasana, otherwise known as Cobra Pose. We're gonna enter this pose from a modified plank and lowering through a modified chaturanga. So if you need to review the details and the modifications of these two postures, please check back for day nine and day 10's video. So coming into our modified plank pose, elbows in nice and close, we're gonna lower all the way down to our bellies. So for cobra pose, we want our legs squeezing together, really adducting the thighs together, and the tops of your feet down on the mat. We're gonna engage through the glutes as well as the low belly, so the pubic bone is pressing down towards the floor. Your tailbone is reaching down, the crown of your head is reaching forward, and you're, to start, your gaze is about at the top edge of your mat. Now your fingers are spread nice and wide and placing them just pretty much underneath your shoulders, elbows squeezing in nice and close. The shoulders are relaxed and away from your ears as well as keeping them nice and wide. So imagine the tips of your shoulders reaching out to opposite sides of the room. So from here, we're gonna start lifting our chest by using the muscles that are in the middle part of the back, as well as the ones that are along each side of our spine. Trying to utilize all the muscles along the spine as we lift up. And once you've kind of found your edge here with your strength, you can begin pressing down towards the floor to help give you a little extra lift. But just going to the point that you still, you still feel the contraction and the opening in the full spine and not just in the low spine. Also making sure that you can keep the tops of your feet down on the mat. Your gaze will just change a little bit depending on how, your, how high you are. So your gaze maybe is forward if you're lifted a little bit up. And if you're lifted a little bit lower, then your gaze will be at the top of your mat. Cobra pose is an excellent pose to help give you a little extra spinal extension because you're using the strength in your back muscles, but you're also able to just kind of press a little bit more, open up the pectoral muscles, all the muscles along the front side of the body. This is also a great one for your adductors. So really squeezing your thighs together and help turning on those thigh muscles, those inner thigh muscles. That's great for your balance as well. Cobra pose is also a wonderful pose to just imagine that you're a cobra. So your legs squeezing together, and then as you rise with that inhale, just being really wide through the chest and just rising with all of that pride of a cobra. So have some fun with this pose, and I will see you tomorrow for day 12. Namaste.